Space. Chances on. And that's the hat trick. Tearing apart this defense time and again. They simply can't handle it. First off, thank you EA and EA Creator Network for providing me an EAFC 24 Xbox code. Hey folks, it's Baron J67 with LV1 Gaming, and I have been playing EAFC 24. Now, I play sports games as if they are an RPG. A class is selected in that case of FC 24, that's a right footed forward. Then it is time to pick a club to start at, which of course is Arsenal. I don't wanna hear it, that's just my squad. After designing my character to look almost sorta kind of like me, I am off to earn a starting spot. EAFC 24 has brought back a few elements from older titles like story mode cutscenes. Your created player is not on a dramatic journey or even voice acted, but there are some scripted scenes that will happen for your player. The career mode allows you to act as your own manager. You pick the type of training you want to take part in and like previous titles, you can play the mini games or simulate them all while boosting the respective stats that go along with those. You can also negotiate for a higher paying contract and the way you get it approved is through meeting the required goals, which can be anything from scoring so many goals or earn so many assists and for sure you're gonna have to get a certain amount of hat tricks. With EA FC 24, your created character's future is completely in your hands. Seriously though, I do not play outside of my career mode in sports games. First step is to go to the settings, the camera angle gets set to broadcast, and the difficulty settings are immediately placed on semi-pro. So far I have about 18 hours of playtime, 85 goals scored, and no plans of putting this game down anytime soon. EAFC 24 falls into the games I played online category, which sounds weird because of how competitive and intense the gameplay can get. But now let's get on to the actual gameplay. So overall, the gameplay is smooth. Being able to weave around defenders never gets old. The moment of digitally dribbling past a defender, then faking out the goalie for a quick assist or a goal is always an epic experience. Only thing that sucks is that EAFC 24 does a good job of reminding me of how old I am when the year 2000 is the furthest you can go back when creating your character. But back on track, the defending is intuitive and engaging. Figuring out your character's timing when tackling will help you to keep from getting a yellow card or you know red and ejected out of the game. Another big standout with the game is the graphics. It was dope seeing the LA Galaxy Stadium when I played a match for the US national team. Having been to that stadium a few times, it was amazing to see the amount of detail that went into it. Overall, graphically, the fans, the manager's reactions, and those dynamic instant replays make for a complete football experience. I know some folks were worried that um, there was going to be a big difference in quality after the license or name change, but based on my time with EAFC 24, it's a hit. Keep in mind that sports games for me are treated like single player experiences, so I can't speak on the couch co-op or the online multiplayer experience, but overall, I'm having a lot of fun with this game and highly recommend you check it out. Much love, thank you again to the EA Creator Network, and if you made it this far, hit that like and subscribe button, and get all your news from LV1Gaming.com's Baron J67. Much love and peace.